1. Christy Manzanares died in an alleged domestic dispute. Christy's death was allegedly the result of a domestic dispute, Princess Cruzes said in a statement. According to the arrest affidavit, a witness told security he went into the couple's cabin and saw Christy on the floor, covered in blood. When he saw Kenneth, her husband, with blood on his hands and clothing, he asked what happened, to which Kenneth allegedly replied, she would not stop laughing at me. Kenneth then allegedly grabbed his wife's body and dragged it towards the cabin's balcony. The witness told security that he himself grabbed Christie's ankles and pulled her back inside the cabin. Moments later, security arrived. While he was being processed by the FBI, Kenneth allegedly said, my life is over. 2. Witnesses say at least one of the couple's daughters was distraught after alleged murder. Witnesses who talked to ABC News described a chaotic scene that drew the attention of many vacationers on the ship. One witness, Jen Larson, said that she heard a woman screaming for her life. According to Larson, one of the onlookers was the Manzanares' young daughter, who she said was distraught and screaming after the incident. She was just really scared, Larson recalled. She said, I just want to go and see my mom. I just want to see my mom. What's happening? 3. Cause of death is pending, but authorities say Manzanara suffered head wound. The federal affidavit describes a grisly scene. Christie was found in a pool of her own blood and she had a severe head wound, but authorities have declined to release other details in the case. An autopsy to determine the cause and manner of death will be completed in Juneau, Alaska. 4. The Alaska-bound cruise left from Seattle. The ship set off from Seattle on Sunday on a week-long trip but was diverted to Juneau, where it docked hours early as a result of the incident. The Emerald Princess was carrying 3,400 passengers and 1,100 crew members, CBS News reports. After the incident. Passengers were placed on lockdown for hours before being allowed to leave the boat. Princess Cruises will issue $150 onboard credit to each passenger because of the inconvenience. 5. Incident occurred during a murder mystery trivia program. Passenger. Some passengers on the cruise initially thought the killing was make-believe and was part of a musical Sherlock Holmes-themed murder mystery trivia program, one passenger told Inside Edition. Most people thought it was just part of the dramatic effect of what they were doing, Vic Simpson told the outlet. A Princess Cruises spokesperson told people there was a music murder trivia game going on that evening.